Hey guys, it is Casey here and welcome back to another video. So, it has been brought to my attention that I have like a good chunk of fake accounts. Like, they're more like, you know, like those like exposing accounts things that were made of me and I totally did not realize this until like now. Like, I don't know if these were all made recently or if some of them were made years ago. I've been doing YouTube, especially MSP YouTube for a very long time. So I honestly don't know how old these are, but I'm just gonna explore some of them, explore the new recent ones, and I'm not like, I just wanna say I don't wear a trade on MSP. I never have, I never will. I don't like the rare trading scene. I am so sorry. I know some of y'all love rare trading on MSP. The only time I ever give out rares is for giveaways. So there's no reason that people should be saying I'm a scammer. I just got off of work, so sorry this video is kind of like like lazy, I guess. But let's just search up my name. So we have a few, few people that pop up here. Um, so this is my backup account. This is owned by me. I made the account years ago. That is my account. Casey Jana A is an account I also made. It was like one of my like, my like little like backup account type things where I would like get to level six and then use the money to buy myself stuff on my main account. Casey Jana D is also a fake account of mine. Casey Jana is a liar. Casey Jana is a liar. <laughs> Are both that I know about already. They are both made for me like um let's see like i think they were made like a few years ago when like some like person was tripping out that i like made like i deleted a comment but i never really did so they were kind of like a whole spectacle over nothing and Casey Jenna Betrayal, Casey Jenna Catfishes, and Casey Jenna Copycat are all three that I was told about today. These are all like level three already. Like people have actually been on these accounts trying to like level up and stuff. So these were all made, I think, today or yesterday. I'm not too sure. But this is what it says. Do not ask me anything about Casey Jenna. And then, and, and this like a sad face. I don't understand. What? I don't, I don't even, I don't. See, I said, who are you on about? Cause like, I don't even know like who who I'm who I'm upset in the community. I'm sorry if I upset you. You know, I'm just here. You know, trying to do content and stuff. You know, and I, I don't try to correct, cause drama. The only drama that I've been in recently was the whole wave situation, which I have been dealt with for like since May. I've dealt with it since May. I know I did the wrong thing in that and I let the drama settle or I let I let it simmer longer than it should have so I don't know who exactly I've upset um but yeah that's one of them gosh MSP also MSP has been really like ever since I every single one of these accounts that I've like made guest book like posts about like these three new ones that I, that I just mentioned every single one of them MSP has like just stopped working after I interacted with the account so I'm not too sure what's that about. But yeah, and it's Casey Jenna Catfishes. She told my friend, asking him, what do you think about my anime YouTube, let's just call them the chest channel, they're big right, ha ha. I mean, I made like two jokes about my VTuber, um, you know, chest being large, but I mentioned this in my debut video. The only reason I made them like that was because A, I don't know, I just like I don't know, the, the anime. Most VTubers out there have large tatas. Like, I don't understand how some people can be offended by that when almost every single VTuber out there, almost, someone's gonna quote me on this and blow up on my face saying like, oh my gosh, she's, she's such a liar. Not every single VTuber out there has big tatas. No, most of them, not all of them, most of them have big, big tatas. And B, I've always drawn Casey with a bigger chest just because... I always draw characters and stuff with a bigger chest and I've always perceived Casey like that. It's my VTuber, like why are you getting pissed off about my own creation that I made and worked hard on? It is none of your business to be like that towards something I created. If you're really pissed off that much about it, then get out, like you don't have to watch my content. My content's not going to be for everybody, like why, why are you so mad about that? And then last one is Casey Jenna copycat. This one says she's copying other YouTubers how to speak. She's catfishing. How am I? I don't understand. First off, the grammar in this is weird. She's copying other YouTubers, quote, how to speak, 
in quote she's catfishing are you saying that i'm like copying how other people talk or copying how my videos are because i've always tried to make very you know unique msp content because let's be honest here it's movie star planet there's gonna be some overlay in videos there's not there's only so much you can do to be unique on this game i am so sorry this game was literally made just to make movies on make art books and make looks and I'm sure like other things but like that's the main three elements of this game that's what's gonna be correlated into your YouTube channel if you make content on strictly MSP I'm so sorry I don't know who I'm copying I'm so sorry if you think I'm copying you I don't mean to I don't like I've said before I don't even watch that much MSP YouTube to begin with so like how do I copy other people you know what I'm saying like the only thing I've remotely even gotten close to it i guess is katie darling but first off katie darling hasn't posted in years and second of all i don't copy her videos i only take inspiration from them it is different when you take inspiration from videos well whatever you know whatever and this is the second one that was kind of worrying me casey jana scam look at all of these that were made they also scam or a variation of scam i don't understand but let me see what these people are on about i know this one was made today they haven't made it a post or anything i don't understand why people think i've scammed before like i said before i don't really really trade that much i don't really i don't trade with people period the only time i've ever done a trade on msp was to buy d packs with cash app funds and i have receipts of me paying these people for msp items i don't have the messages anymore because i deleted my old discord but i have receipts of me paying these people for msp items that they asked for that is the only time i've ever like done a transaction from msp unless it was a very long time ago when i was very young i have evidence where she said she only makes her youtube channel to use her fans who where has i said that i don't even remember where i've said that like even when i first started posting back in 2019 i don't think i've ever said that would someone quote me word for word if i've ever said that why would i use my youtube channel to use my fans i never had fans to begin with before this channel my first channel has 42 subscribers in order to get fans you have to have the youtube channel so why would i make the youtube channel to use my non-existent fans that I never had before. This is not making sense unless it's broken English. But like, I seriously don't understand what these people are going on about. I Maybe I'm just stupid, you know? I don't know, but like, I don't know how I even pissed off someone to make all these accounts. This one hasn't made a st uh, status update yet, okay? What about this guy? What, 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 what are you saying? She never intends to be your friend if you don't gift her. What do you mean? I am friends with so many people that I've never even gifted before. Like, what? I don't really care. I mean, the only time I ever do mail times... Are, is someone mad from the mail time video? <laughs> someone has to be mad for my mail time. I am so sorry I made you upset over opening gifts that people have sent me. I literally said you don't have to send me gifts. I don't care if you send me gifts you know i i just i just do this for fun guys like why do you think what okay anyway i really don't understand i really don't understand casey jana scammer one she's using people for money <laughs> okay okay girly whoever said i'm making money off of youtube i just want to show you how much I, I feel like i shouldn't be showing y'all but the only payment i've ever gotten from youtube was during my break and that was over like six months of ad revenue piling up and that was just a hundred dollars i'm not even joking that was that was it that's all i've ever been paid from youtube hands down i haven't got any other tips from anywhere else the only money i make remotely close to that is from commissions art commissions that i do as a transaction as a goods of services and the only people that the only person that's ever commissioned me for real money is vin msp multiple times he has commissioned me for like I think it's like four or five different art pieces throughout the years. I don't, I don't, how, how am I using people for money if I don't even get money? The only way I get money is from ad revenue. That's like maybe a dollar per video. That's it. If I'm using you for a dollar, I am, I'm so sorry. I, I don't know, man. All right, let's see what the next one's about. She asked me to add her new account and I said, okay. Then she said I never did enough for her and blocked me. Huh? I don't, I don't, this is my only account on MSP besides like the UK server, but the most recent account I think I've ever made was the Finnish server or something like that. Then she said I never did enough for her and blocked me. 
I haven't blocked anyone at recently at all. Okay, anyway, let's let's keep going. Let's keep going, guys. Casey Jayla, scammer, scam. Scammer get scammed, buddy. Scammer get scammed. I love that audio so much. <laughs> She added some people on her new account and forced them to give her VIP ticket. What? I don't have a new account. Oh, someone might be in impersonating me. Oh, they're probably. Oh, oh, they're probably. Um, so I might have an impersonator, guys. Before I go on anymore, this is my only. This is my only account. Period. I have no idea. I someone might be impersonating me. I have no idea if they are. I don't have another account. The only account I have are the ones with several subscriptions. Besides my backup account. I am worried that I have a impersonator now because this is two people now saying that I've impersonated or that I'm that I am asking people for VIP tickets. I have never asked anyone for a VIP ticket. I never have, I never will. If I want VIP that bad, I have two jobs. I get paid a good little I, I Besides paying my bills, I have money left over. If I really want VIP, I can just buy myself. If you guys don't believe me, you just kind of have to trust me, okay? Alright, last one is Casey Jenna scam. Scam scams. Casey just gives them auto to let them know she has a new account and scams them there. Now it's worrying me that I have an impersonator, guys. Okay, I also have one more that someone sent me. Let me see. I gotta have to pull up the picture. Give me one second, guys. I also gotta check Discord. Let's see. MSP is bugging out on me, as always. Okay. <laughs> so I have one more <laughs> that someone sent me. It says, Casey, you're not trying to use Lush. Okay. We're not gonna let you portray Lush. <laughs> okay. So I was actually sent to this by Lush themselves. <laughs> So, I've been in contact with Lush since my previous video about them came out. I just want to say that I'm not trying to use Lush in any way. I really, I promise I've actually been wanting to get to know them a little bit more. So, they did contact me on Twitter, like I said before. And we've actually been in contact since. And we've just been chatting and stuff like that. I've been asking them some questions about, you know, the account. Because I've gotten some... Uh, comments about it and they have let me know the situation that has been this had happened in the past i don't want to talk about our personal conversation a private conversation but yes we have been in contact we have told each other some very personal things and i promise i'm not trying to use lush for anything i really like i said i don't really care about msp that much anymore so i kind of like don't really care why like what happens to my account in the sense that i don't care if i'm rich or if i'm famous on here or if i'm just like like i'm literally just here to make videos and just to give updates and news and stuff and i don't know just be a silly little vtuber that a lot of people don't like apparently i don't know why a lot of people don't like my vtuber oh my gosh i'm gonna have to like change i'm gonna have to change your cup size or something because some people are really pissed off about that but I'm literally just here making videos on what I love and what I enjoy. And one of them is or was MSP. And that's what I'm, you know, kind of known for. So I'm not trying to use anybody. Like, I really... Why would why would I benefit from using Lush? I just made some videos on Lush. And oh, let me, let me talk about that too. Because some people are like, oh my gosh, you're like buddies, buddies now with Lush. I get buddy buddies with anybody. I don't really... Yes, I have friends. Lush is a friend. But why am I trying to use them? The only reason I made the update video about Lush getting their account back is because I had a lot of people telling me that Lush got the account back. And I was like, well, I don't want people to think that I got, you know, that, that I'm just focusing on the bad and that Lush is, you know, because what if I never made that other, you know, the, the update video? Then people are going to think of Lush, you know, that doesn't play in the US server, that Lush is hacked in for, to forever and never got their account back. I want to make updates on stuff like that, you know, and say, hey, you know, I was, you know, hey, this happened. Yay, we can all be happy now. You know, Lush got the account back, whatever. That's the only reason I made a video. I'm not trying to, like, do it for pu publicity you know, I don't really care. I was famous before I famous. I was like mildly famous. Mildly in a very, very interesting term. Mildly famous before I even met Lush, before I even made that video about Lush. I made that video, what, like a week ago? A week ago I had 2.9k subs. 10 subscribers more than, uh, less than what I have now. 
Ooh, that last video gave me 10 subscribers. Ooh. What? What are y'all on about? Seriously. Whoever I pissed off, whoever that I made upset, I don't know. I'm sorry. I'm just gonna have to say it now. Disclaimer, guys. I I don't have a new account quote. I might have an impersonator. Might have a impersonator. Um, don't believe everything you see on MSP, guys, or the internet. A lot of people can, you know, make lies just like, like that. Um, a lot of people can bullshit other things. Honestly, just, it's very easy for rumors to spread on MSP. I've seen it happen. I've seen it with my own eyes. I'm only here on MSP to relive my childhood and to make videos on a game I used to love. Now MSP has gone literally to a shithole. Um, it is so toxic now. It is so unbelievably a bad place to be around sometimes. And this is the main reason. But yeah, if you're the one impersonating me, get out. Get out! I'm joking. I'm joking. <laughs> I'm joking, I promise. Um, if you're the one impersonating me, please look deep into your heart and try to find some kindness to your soul and please stop. Because it's hurting my reputation. And I, and I, and I do take pride in my reputation sometimes, so you know, help Curly out, please. <laughs> I've worked very hard on my YouTube. Please, please don't. Please don't like destroy it, you know what I'm saying? Uh, but yeah, anyway, I got a live stream to do. I got a live stream to do, guys. So yeah, that's gonna be it for this video. Thank you all so much for watching and listening to me ramble. And yeah, stay safe out there, guys. Stay safe.